Air Force Space Command is a major command of the United States Air Force USAF, with its headquarters at Peterson Air Force Base, Colorado. AFSPC supports U.S. military operations worldwide through the use of many different types of space operations. AFSPC is subordinate to U.S. Strategic Command As of 2019 it is the primary space force for the U.S. Armed Forces. More than 38,000 people perform AFSPC missions at 88 locations worldwide, they include military personnel of the USAF, Air Force Reserve and Air National Guard, Department of the Air Force Civilians and civilian contractors. The Air Force Global Strike Command has responsibility for Intercontinental Ballistic Missiles ICBMs. History In 1982, the United States Space Command was formed to centralize missile warning operations formerly a tactical air command responsibility, and space launch operations formerly an Air Force Systems Command responsibility. In 1985, Space Command was renamed Air Force Space Command In 1991, the lessons learned during Operation Desert Storm provided emphasis for AFPSC's new focus on support to other branches of the military. The AFSPC was the subject of a 60 Minutes news segment on CBS in April 2015. When speaking with reporter David Martin, Commanding General John E. Highton was able to state that the program was doing its part in keeping the global world of GPS satellites and other important global satellite usage peaceful. Possible issues included the development of anti-satellite technology, and the new Boeing X-37 spaceplane was also discussed. In 2016, Space Command began their Space Mission Force concept of operations to respond quickly to attacks in space. Each space wing undergoes special training, then serves a four to six month rotation. Mission According to AFSPC, its mission is to «provide resilient and affordable space capabilities for the joint force and the nation». AFSPC's primary mission areas are National Security Space Launch – the launching of satellites and other high-value payloads into space using a variety of expendable launch vehicles and operating those satellites once in space Space Control – ensuring the friendly use of space through the conduct of counterspace operations encompassing surveillance, negation, protection and space intelligence analysis Force enhancement, providing satellite-based weather, communications, intelligence, missile warning, and navigation. Topic: <laughs> Space capabilities. Operations at Vandenberg Air Force Base and Cape Canaveral Air Force Station provide services, facilities and range safety control for the conduct of space launches. The AFSPC is responsible for the command and control of all U.S. DOD satellites, providing global coverage, secure communications, weather and navigational data, and threat warning. Ground-based radar and defense support program satellites monitor ballistic missile launches around the world to guard against a surprise missile attack on North America. Space surveillance radars provide vital information on the location of satellites and space debris for the nation and the world. 
Space situational awareness is the most important protective measure that can be applied to satellites, which are inherently vulnerable due to the physics of spaceflight. As of 2013, AFSPC was also considering the replacement of a few large multi-mission satellites with larger numbers of smaller single-purpose platforms. This could be used to defend against ASATs by increasing the number of targets that would need to be attacked to neutralize space-based capabilities. Launch service agreements In 2016, the U.S. Congress authorized the USAF to co-finance the development of new launch vehicles. The revised contracting structure fits with the USAF's broader goal of getting out of the business of buying rockets and moving to instead acquire launch services from companies. Initial cost-sharing partnerships were signed with United Launch Alliance ULA, SpaceX, Orbital ATK, and Aerojet Rocketdyne. The USAF would initially like to move to having two domestic launch service providers, instead of being reliant on ULA. As of March 2018, the Air Force intended to select three companies by mid-year 2018 so that the Space and Missile Systems Center could contract for launch system prototypes. In October 2018, the U.S. Air Force announced three companies as winners of LSA launch vehicle development contracts. Blue Origin received $500 million for New Glenn, Northrop Grumman was awarded $792 million for Omega Development, and ULA received $967 million for Vulcan Centaur. SpaceX did not receive an LSA award. Resources Topic: Satellites. Advanced Extremely High Frequency. Defense Satellite Communication System. Defense Meteorological Satellite Program. Defense Support Program. Fleet Satellite Communications System (UHF) follow-on. Global Positioning System. MILSTAR NATO-3 and IV Communications Space-based space surveillance Launch vehicles Atlas V Delta IV Falcon 9 as of December 2018 Topic: Space situational awareness. Air Force Satellite Control Network. Maui Optical Tracking Identification Facility. Ground-based electro-optical deep space surveillance system. Passive space surveillance system. Rapid attack identification detection reporting system. An FPS 85 space track radar. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Ballistic missile warning radars. An FPS 115 pave pause. An FPS 108 Cobra Dane. An FPQ-16 Perimeter Acquisition Radar Characterization System Parks. Sea-based X-band radar. Ballistic Missile Early Warning System (BMEWS). Topic: Organization. Topic. 14th Air Force 
The 14th Air Force 14 AF is an active numbered air force that is located at Vandenberg AFB, California. It is responsible for launching payloads to space from facilities in California and Florida and manages the generation and employment of space forces to support U.S. Strategic Command and North American Aerospace Defense Command operational plans and missions. Direct reporting units AFSPC is responsible for providing space assets to the U.S. Strategic Command. AFSPC also supports NORAD with ballistic missile warning information, operates the Space Warfare Center to develop space capabilities, and is responsible for the U.S.ICBM follow-on operational test and evaluation program. The Space and Missile Systems Center SMC at Los Angeles AFB, California, designs and acquires all Air Force and most Department of Defense space systems. It oversees launches, completes on-orbit checkouts, then turns systems over to user agencies. It supports the Program Executive Officer for Space on the NAVSTAR Global Positioning, Defense Satellite Communications and MILSTAR Systems. SMC also supports the Defense Meteorological Satellite Program and the follow-on Early Warning System. In addition, it supports development and acquisition of land-based intercontinental ballistic missiles for the Air Force Program Executive Office for Strategic Systems. <laughs> <laughs> Locations The AFSPC headquarters is a major unit located at Peterson AFB, Colorado. There are six AFSPC host bases Buckley AFB, Colorado 460th Space Wing 233rd Space Group Colorado Air National Guard Los Angeles AFB, California Space and Missile Systems Center Global Positioning Systems Directorate Space Superiority Systems Directorate Launch Systems Directorate Infrared Space Systems Directorate Defense Weather Systems Directorate Military Satellite Communications Systems Directorate Space Logistics Directorate Missile Defense Systems Directorate Space Development and Test Directorate Kirtland AFB, New Mexico Spacelift Range and Network Systems Division 61st Air Base Group 61st Civil Engineering and Logistics Squadron 61st Medical Squadron 61st Mission Support Squadron Patrick AFB and Cape Canaveral AFS, Florida 45th Space Wing 114th Space Control Squadron Florida Air National Guard Peterson AFB, Colorado 21st Space Wing 821st Air Base Group GSU at Thule Air Base, Greenland 20th Space Control Squadron GSU at Eglin AFB Site C6, Florida 310th Space Wing AFRC Schriever AFB, Colorado 50th Space Wing Space Innovation and Development Center Vandenberg AFB, California 14th Air Force 30th Space Wing 148th Space Operations Squadron K 
California Air National Guard AFSPC also operates several Air Force stations for launch support and early warning missions. Cape Cod Air Force Station, Massachusetts 6th Space Warning Squadron Cavalier AFS, North Dakota 10th Space Warning Squadron Cheyenne Mountain AFS, Colorado Cheyenne Mountain Division Clear Air Force Station, Alaska 13th Space Warning Squadron 213th Space Warning Squadron Alaska Air National Guard Greeley Air National Guard Station, Colorado 137th Space Warning Squadron Colorado Air National Guard New Boston AFS, New Hampshire 23D Space Operations Squadron Topic: List of commanders. Topic: See also. List of government space agencies. United States Space Surveillance Network. United States Space Force. NASA comparable organizations. United States Army Space and Missile Defense Command Naval Network Warfare Command US Navy